Let's start coding. First, let me arrange these files. That looks nice. Now, I'm going to start coding and I'm using bracket, a code editor. You can download this code editor for free or you, or you can use any code editing software you like. Let's create a new file. Save it on on this folder. Name it as index index.html. I will code the basic HTML code for this project. I gave it a title switch buttons and light bulb. Here I'm going to bring my first image. is btn1.gpg and here I bring the bulb one dot jpg Let's start by opening this file using Google Chrome. Now you see the button here and the light bulb. Next step is to bring the jQuery library to our project. by creating this tag let me copy this file name and paste it here I want this button to be clickable this one it should, this one should be clickable so what I'm going to do is to add the unclick listener to this element when it is clicked when it's clicked it will call this function So the next step is to create that function. My idea is when I click this button, this image should be changed to the second image, which is PTN2. So let's make it happen. First, I need to give it an ID. Give it an ID. I call it button. Before starting coding this function, let's create a, a variable. I call it switch on. The default value of this 
variable is false now inside this function when whenever it's called it will check is this switch on true or false if switch on variable is true then it should make it off otherwise it should be on to test it I'm going to call an alert function here so when it switch on or when it is switch off we can see an alert saying that it's switch off let me copy that and paste it here this one is on save it and let me and let's refresh the page and click it now it's switched on okay when I click it again it should be switch off it's switch off click it again and it will be on and off the next step is I want if I switch this on instead of showing this image we should show this this one and if we switch it off it should show the first image stay tuned and see you on next video